My next cultural experience came about unexpectedly. For Easter, I went to Bruce's host parents' house for Easter dinner, and that was planned, but I was expecting their family to be there. Instead, they were actually hosting two exchange students. Um, they were both post-grad students studying in America for one year. Uh, one was from Bhutan, his name was Doji, and the other was from Uganda, his name was Munanura, and I was surprised to see them there, but instantly intrigued because I had never personally met someone from either of those countries. Um, I was also a little nervous too because I didn't know anything about their cultures and I didn't really know what to say to them. But we sat down and ate an Easter meal. We had the traditional ham and sweet potatoes and they were not used to this kind of food and um, John and Susan, Bruce's host parents, had to explain what they tasted like even because Munanura said like in Uganda sweet potatoes are look and taste so different. Um, they talked about what it's like in their home countries and their own personal cultures. For example, Doji is a Buddhist and this was his first time ever celebrating Easter. Um, Munanura uh, explained how he was in America studying the police force and their tactics because back home he's a prison guard and he talked about his first time seeing a taser and using one um, because they don't have them in Uganda and I thought that was interesting. I didn't know that. Um, it was also interesting when at one point he got up to take a phone call and he was speaking in his native language. I had never heard that language being spoken before. Um, the, probably the most difficult part of the meal was the accents because we had three people there with accents and then to them, me, John, and Susan, the Americans, we had accents too. So sometimes we would have to ask each other to repeat ourselves, which wasn't a problem. Otherwise, there wasn't much of a language barrier. Everybody knew English. Um, it was also interesting to uh, have John and Susan explain the American Easter traditions to Doji and Munanura because they had never seen an Easter egg before. They were so fascinated by these colored eggs. And they also explained the Easter Bunny story to them and it was just all new to them. And I had never eaten a meal, a holiday meal, with people that weren't used to American traditions. and. It was very eye-opening to see um, what what they celebrate and how they celebrate their holidays. Um, other than that, it was an experience that went very well. I felt very comfortable being there.